The Perth Wildcats are raging favourites with sporting bookmakers around the country to win their first NBL championship in 10 years. And the Hawks hit town today. Their hopes of taking the title will rest heavily on causing an upset tomorrow night in Game 1 of the Grand Final Series. The enemy arrived, Wollongong touching down late this afternoon with high hopes of championship glory. For the Wildcats, the pre-game build-up involved a grand final breakfast with some basketball legends. We don't need to do anything different. We need to play Wildcat basketball, which is what Bevo's done all year. I think we're going to go all the way in two. I think you're going to see three hard-fought games. There's going to be no 20-point blowouts like there were in the semi-finals. They're too well coached, too well disciplined and... Um, you know, they've got some weapons that can hurt us. While the game's best had differing views, the coaches had some troubles with the trophy. Whoever packed it may have thought these two teams didn't deserve to be fighting for the title. It's a bit surreal. Yeah, you know, I mean, I stand here and there's so many people, we have these breakfasts. Uh, it's gone out of control with the media and uh, you do reflect and think, well, hang on, we're, we're doing something pretty special over here. And, uh, you know, I'm starting to... Yeah, get, get the butterflies already. The Hawks hoping to swoop and do what many believe will be impossible, stealing game one in front of the Wildcats' feral fans. The Cats spurred on by support from all parts of the state. The visitors are community-owned and much-loved and happy to draw inspiration from their incredible rise to the top of the table after almost folding eight months ago. It's not a surprise for us where we are right now. Lockie Reed, 10 News.